your boy Dan Squad. It's your boy and back with you guys with another video. So we're going to check out when Godzilla and Kong showed everyone why they run the monster bar the monsterverse by Chi Jutsu. Hey man, that uh, Godzilla and Kong uh, movie that they dropped like a few few months back. Yo, this yo Godzilla and Kong, even though they're feud back in like other old Godzilla movies. They run their fades are like really insane and now that they went from ops to bros and when they were releasing like new evil uh monsters into it when godzilla and kong came together you know full fact they they really proved that they were not to be messed with who really runs runs a joint if you know what i mean but i know this is going to be a really dope video chijitsu shout out to you bro for dropping this so enough with the chit chat let's get down to business appreciate all the love support you guys have shown to channel at least recently if you're new to channel make sure you want them like subscribe tap that bell so you don't miss any videos that i post also your boy has a second channel it's called in on anime i'm gonna be dropping that video sometime uh this this week coming make sure i'll leave it down in the description uh description box show some love on that and without further ado let's get it Because of the Lord's great love, we are not consumed, for his compassions never fail. They are new every morning. Great is your faithfulness. Lamentations 3.32-23. Amen. So it starts, and Kong over here playing tug-of-war with this Pokemon for some good eats. But then bro heard this roar and was like, do Did my eyes deceive me? Ah. Uh, it's a man bounce. took this it's as a challenge. Down. Boy said, I know fools ain't pushing pain on my turf. This Skull Island. Y'all must ain't see my movie. I put this hood on the map. Cone pulled up to scope the scene. But this whole time, it was just this little frog creature over here set tripping. Cone pulled up to this Minecraft ravine with this diamond pickaxe. Think he finna go farm some minerals. Bro looked down and knew he was about to get some enchanted diamond armor. He landed yep. and saw the ape shaped skulls. Man's look flabbergasted, like his name gonna be next in somebody's bio. It must have been some of his dead homies from way back. Kong walked Possibly. through this waterfall and entered a whole new biome. But this place already on timing. You got this Kevin Durant shadow build walking up on bro. Man's Kong squared up immediately. Can't never catch bro lacking no more after them beatdowns Godzilla put on him in the last movie. But oh, looks yeah. What Godzilla did to Kong in that last movie, yo, my man got, yo. Godzilla was giving Kong the beating of a lifetime. Are deceiving because it was just little Diddy Kong. Kong tried to dap bro up out of respect, but Diddy was like, oh, heck no. Nah, and bit that boy oh, Kong wow, on the wow, finger wow. like he was taking a chump out of a glizzy. Hey, then he gonna run away. Boss. Man's just pulled the weakest hit and run I've ever seen in my life because oh, all it took was five strides and Kong was about to two step on the back of little man's head. Kong got high alert on though, cause soon yep. as he entered that other section, somebody dropped behind him. Ugh. Or should I say something? Cause I know this not no ape. Bro, it looked like somebody took Caesar from Planet of the Apes DNA and tried to cook up a Kong clone in the test. Digging that was gonna do something, but all it turns out was complete another garbage. Too. But OG Kong over here like, oh, they done took my guy to great clips. They skipped all the formalities though. And two out spirit Kong pushing his head into the ground. But Kong down here like, wait, hold up. My name is in the movie title. It's up for y'all. He slammed this rock against bro's head, turning his brain into pudding. And somebody called Dana White. We got your next star. Cause and you know for a fact that CTA was gonna kick in on one of them gorillas. We got apes pulling off rear naked chokes now. But his man's over here team killing and caved his head in. Just Damn. to catch an overhead to his spine. Ooh. Boy, I know bro gonna be feeling that tomorrow. Catching oh, a two-ton hammer fist to your back will put anybody down. Smooth mm -hmm. Brain wanted to get his get back though and tried to sneak Kong. But dude caught this Flintstone bone and looked at bro like, this not your body, my G. Booming. And also it's GG on your ass too. Him into his little homie. Now Thing One tried to end Kong's career with that enchanted battle axe, but caught a leg bone to the bottom of his chin. Bro finna have to chitty, eat chitty, liquid chitty. banana after that lit. While trying to receive his strap, Diddy Kong pulled up on Lil Rascal time and tried to reorganize Kong's face. Lil Man thought it was sweet and got turned into a melee weapon. One, two, finish it. Three goofy niggas down. Bro Kong really squat wiping these doodle bobs. Man's is a... Basically, long story short, he just 4v1 all of them just like that. Solo Q Menace, and these must be some short bus apes. 
Cause Thanks. they not learning they listen. Bro mm -hmm. caught a hook to his noggin and he's out for the count. Slumped. He up talking to He up there. Sleeping. Kobe trying to figure out how to be the same animal and a different beast. RP Black Mamba. But why Kong going devious timing? Bro really down smash bro's back in. Even oh. if he lives this fade, he gonna have scoliosis for life now. But oh Kong's God. still not done. Like what? What's wrong, These fools monkey? must got him in that Check mode. Up. He lifts bro's head up to scramble his teeth around. And it took a sneak attack from his homie to stop Kong from turning his head into mashed potatoes. Yeah. Kong yep. really a real nigga just trying to find some real homies is all. But bro right here, mm -hmm. he really deserved his fate. Cause how you gonna get saved and instantly get back to Hoenn? Kong parried that attack and told- Stupid. He, he should've let, let him drop to his death. Oh Brody, this is Skull Island, nigga. And Sparta kicked him off the ledge. The Caesar clone knew it was up and tried mm -hmm. to skedaddle lot the spot. Cone picked up this rock, deciding to show off his QB skills. Man's really all pro in this throwing jump. He tossed a Hail Mary way in the sky. Dome and bro in the back of his neck, just cause he felt like it. This goofy Cone really petty for real. He know he dang is. well that was unnecessary. Then he had to keep up the bad cop act, pulling out little Diddy Cone over here bush camping like he in Fortnite, booming him on his shoulder, trying to get him to ah. drop the location of the ops. Little bro was like, all right, dang bro. It ain't even that serious. So Kong and his sidekick pulled up to the spot. Kong looking like Phantom when he finds out all he got left to eat is some salad. He like, MLK <laughs> didn't die for this. Slavery in my hood? Oh, heck nah. So he walks down there, and this is where I knew it. Whoever is in control of this operation ain't with the games. Because tell me why it... And nope. And boy, oh boy, that... For my man doing that 4v1 and whoever was controlling that, you know for a fact they were going to be on some demon timing, if you know what I mean. Pants past three ape kebabs just sitting in the middle of the yard. Like, what y'all doing? Y'all just don't see this? This is clearly an act of Black Air Force energy. Oh, we God. dealing with a real psychopath, ain't it? Cone sees one of the yard commanders harassing someone and slid in for a talk. Yepatron came in spitting all kinds of hot fire in bro's face. So Cone slapped some CTE across his jaw so he won't forget to brush his teeth next time and then started banging on his chest, letting them know he not here for all talk and no action. After that display of outright aggression, the Titan Reaper himself is revealed. Skull King. Man's posing on the throne with all this spiritual pressure. And from this beast Titan build, I knew Kong was finna take his first L of the movie. And yep. bro's eyes are Once that uh red red Kong came into the picture, yeah, I already knew from the jump that Kong was really gonna take a L on this fight. Crystal blue. Nigga got that Gojo effect. I'm not Thanks. even sure if Kong the main character anymore. Dude walks out punking all yeah. the apes. And he is literally on anime character timing. I wouldn't be surprised if he hit a flash step and popped the Do domain expansion. Got Kong looking up like, oh dang, he looking kind of comfy. Scar came down, sizing Kong up, even sticking his grimy hands all over Kong's VBS grill. And this is where we see bro's griminess on display. While everyone laughing, bro got tight with Lil Diddy Kong for bringing bro here. But his big homie was like, chill Scar, it ain't that serious. Scar like, yeah. You right, looking Kong dead in the face before he drop kicks bro dead into a pool of time to meet Jesus. Oh Damn. yeah, it's up. Kong uh, is heated and Scar yeah. ain't no hope. Clear it, clear it. They finna bang out. Both mm -hmm. these menaces strap up and the scrubs start dropping the fight music. Scar swings that bone whip at Kong and man's really weave nation with that dodge. He started feeling himself trying to grab the whip like this mug not laced with jagged edges. Got his hand looking like the roof of my mouth when I eat Captain Crunch. Right here is where Kong has his first nigga moment. He rushed in, got weaved twice with ease. Scar moving like he been training for this all his life. Then yep. he parries the battle axe, weaving out to give Kong a little love tap on his shoulder. Kong thought he could be Weave Nation and Sneaker Nation certified, but called him uppercut instead. Scar unarmed bro, then put him into one of those Auntie Anne's pretzel knots choking him. Kong saw Lil Diddy looking at him and was like, I ain't finna be grits today. Hitting that Uno reverse, then slammed Scar on his spleen, but bro was starving. So he ate that jump and called off his jumper nigga unit. And Kong, I'ma be real. It might be chalk for you, bro. Dude just ate a Batista bomb and then posed like a JoJo's character. It turns out 
Bro, not just enslaving apes, but even legendary Pokemon. Man's think he's ass catch him. Now we get introduced to this From menace Pokemon. Shimo. Scar uses that crystal to make Shimo attack Kong with that spearmint breath. He barely oh. escapes that first blast, grabbing his axe, blocking the- Good thing he escaped from it, cause trust me, if he would've got hit, Kong, it would've been GG's for him. The second one, but this junk got an AOE effect, turning his hand into a popsicle. Right oh. before Kong finna get sent to the gulag, Diddy Kong mm. show him the escape route, so he doesn't get turned into Italian ice. Got Scar over here with his strap. That's like the equivalent of getting your chain snatched by a random nigga. This yep. junk low-key not fair though. Bro's build is too OP. Man's is a demigod build with a one-shot monster pit. Facts. So Kong pulled up to Egypt. Bro came out the portal gripping the pyramids with this infinity gauntlet. Man's gets break. one upgrade and thinks he's Thanos. But Godzilla wasn't with Or like, or still some, uh, some armor from Transformers as well. But the games. Niggas pulling up on his turf, ain't gonna cut it. Dude stood up like he finna put LLK. Long live Kong in someone's bio. And tell me why bro has a play stretch build. They got mans looking too athletic. Kong threw up his set, cause he ain't no hoe. Godzilla said, I right, bet. You think I'm playing? I'm, I'm pulling, pulling up, up on you, you nigga. And dove into the ocean like Mike Phelps. Bro, Godzilla really a crash out to be honest. Dude got dissed one time and now he thinks it's cool to casually tarnish thousands of civilians in his domestic violence against Kong. Man seeing red and starts saying freak everybody. Godzilla jumped out that water and started pressing Kong. But Kong realized mid press that he really came to just get help for bro to beat Scar and Shimo. He like, hey bro, chill, chill. We got a common op game. Godzilla was like, freak all that and tackled bro like he was Aaron Donald. Nigga eradicated thousands of years worth of world history with the pyramid. These kaiju have no respect, bro, I tell you. Nope. Got Kong mm -hmm. over here posted up, rethinking his current situation. But yep. bro locked in though, and threw some grime in Godzilla's <laughs> eyes. Mans ran noggin first into another pyramid. He like, oh man. That was weak, and started throwing a tantrum. And what happens next? literally makes this movie s tier in the fight category bro oh, press God. kong against the wall and has to remind everyone that his name hold weight he picks up kong and i'm talking feet off the ground type jump then he hit bro with that kaiju suplex kong got a dose of instant cte after that boom like what yep. are they feeding these niggas bro i would have never thought there would be a day i see my twin kong get boomed on his spinacus but Thanks. Kong is a get back guru, I tell you that. Bro loaded up that infinity gauntlet, sending a nuke into Godzilla jaw. Fool really got one shot at. Is this really your This your king? And also throw up the X for, for Godzilla too. Yo goat, cause my nigga Kong doing him the worst way. I can't lie. I never let another nigga have me on my back. So that's just me. But Kong not done with bro and puts him in a combo extender, then spams him with heavy attacks <laughs> laced with concussion stones from the infinity gauntlet, putting that boy to sleep. Man's yep. really got humble for real. He to change his name to Godzilla with a lowercase g, cause he ain't no god for real. Kong over here dragging bro to another phase like he just had some lightweight. But he heard that infamous charge up and knew it was finna be crash out city. And it was gonna be GG's Kong too. looked back like Godzilla really weak for real. Got to pull out the blast breath every time he finna lose a fight. Man's ain't trying to throw no hands for real. He don't no struggle. He got like three Zenkai boosts in this movie alone in his five minute cameo. That blast breath made a smoke screen, clearing the way for this spear to the gut. Then he curb stomps Kong into the earth, charging up another easy way for Kong to see his dead homies. Right here? I thought it was up for Kong. Man's really finna get crisped up into some pork rinds from this radioactive lizard. Well, right. listen to this moth kaiju showed up to recruit them for the anti-scar campaign. Look at it. Two ops made friends about to stand on business. So we switched to a new fade scenery and Scar came in destroying junk like he owned the place. I'm talking Thanks. one, two, three, four, multiple goofies deep and think yep. he's finna run some pockets. But all Thanks. we hear in the background is And what do we know? Two real niggas have arrived. My boy Kong and Frazilla came out the smoke hauling Frazilla. booty towards Scar and Shimo. I know these fools would've gave you same boat a run for his money. I can't lie though. This scene of two monkeys riding in on these legendary Pokemon? Chef's kiss. Oh, Whoever God. cooked this up? Yeah, they need a raise. Oh yeah, for this fight alone, whoever came up with this, more than a race, you need a, you need a, 
Kai raids vacation for sure. But right before Kong was finna put Scar on layaway, the gravity reset, inverting all their settings. Now they fighting in the air, and Kong is about to get dead dirty. Cause Scar is in the assassin class with the movement. Man's yep. flipping from rock to rock, and initiating a fade with circle spams. Bro mm -hmm. wrapped Kong up, and put five toe jams into his <coughs> mouth. And look at Frozilla over here not holding his weight, getting hit with that spearmint beam. Got the moth shawty saving this man. But he came out the ice on timing, literally swimming through the air to crash out on Shimo. The gravity starts to get a new update, and all the kaiju begin to fall back into the earth realm portal. Scar and Shimo came out that portal like they had black air forces on. While Shimo over here making the next Ice Age move with IRL, Scar over here celebrating like he already had the dub. He like, yeah, this my hood now. But Kong pop that fade stone in his gauntlet and rock bro straight to sleep. Bro got up and spit a building sized tooth out his mouth. Got Kong like, dang, I really rocked that nigga. Even Fryzilla hit a point blank blast breath at Shimo gut. Now this fade then turned into a bang out session. These kaiju really going. Forget bang out, it was strong. It was strong in hands, put it that way. Lick for licking this fade. And now, I guess Kong done realized it. Bro looked inside this building and saw the humans in turmoil and was like, dang, we really be trampling on these fools when we be throwing hands, don't we? And it's about time, bruh. I thought these casual homicides these kaiju was committing on humankind would go unnoticed. Shimo came in charging at Kong, but Godzilla speared, bro, just to get tossed aside like the Elite Socks and Sperry's combo after 2016. It oh pans back to Hollow Earth, where Lil Diddy If you know, you know, I'm leaving at that. Kong done found Kong's battle axe, right here, I knew the bang out session was coming to an end because if this axe gets used, somebody's getting greased. Scar yep. grabs a building and throws it at Kong, but after blocking it, he gets flip kicked into a combo where Shimo is mushing his face into the city, giving him that Broly treatment. But while this grimy oh, yeah. behavior is taking place, just like how Goku got violated by Broly in that Broly second movie, Kong got violated just like that. Godzilla renews his sneaking nation badge and charges up a final flash. Man think he's Vegeta. Scar looks back in huh? disbelief. Bro is baffled at this sight. But before he gets sent back to the lobby, he pulls this <laughs> exquisite weave out of his bag. He slung that whip at Godzilla, and bro catches oh. it looking at him like, I might not be a gorilla, but I got that gorilla grip. Oh, pause. Then he booms bro on his back and breaks his strap. Man's finna get exposed without his melee weapon. Meanwhile, Kong over here fighting the Sub-Zero variant, and he's losing. But Godzilla comes in with a third party, biting bro's neck. This Damn. gave Kong just enough time to recoup, but before he could get right, Scar pressed him. Then here comes a familiar scene. My guy is getting put in yet another rear naked choke. Like, bro, I know you done at least came up with a counter for that by now. It pans Next. back and Diddy Kong dragging his behind into frame with Kong's axe. Kong gave him that look like, do it for the gang, little bro. Kong bit dude's arm. Probably gonna have to talk to that boy Magic Johnson after that blood hit his system. But Facts. Diddy Kong hit that little move and broke the crystal, sending everybody flying back. Scar gets up and grabbed Diddy Kong by his neck just to catch a haymaker to his jaw. Damn. And here's another example of peak cinema. Kong grabbed bro and was like, I'm sorry for what we are about to do to you, and throws him at Godzilla, who then tail whips him back at Kong, playing ping pong with Rose's body. Kong holds him up for the finishing blow, and Shimo comes to his senses like, shoot, let me get in on this, and hits bro with that spearmint beam cannon. Got dude's body on thin ice while Kong is gripping him by the neck, then Kong had to go ahead and put him down jumping off this building from max height to obliterate scar across the rubble these guys are getting out of hand bro they getting athletic and they acquiring weapons of mass destruction like who they fighting next because these goofies looking mighty op hey oh y'all know what to do smash that like button comment and subscribe and go ahead and buy them heads dear lord thank you yet again your children gather here in your name with a humble heart we just come here to dwell in your presence in you we find peace and we know love without you we are nothing so thank you in jesus name i pray amen amen uh, jutsu mafia hidden technique peace jesus the greatest the greatest jesus the yep and just like that y'all that's gonna do it for this video because godzilla and kong yo 
they really proved that they are the monsterverse. Like they went from throwing the fade back at Egypt and most likely fighting uh that re that other other gods of uh, the other Kong and stuff. Yo, and that was so dirty that they were playing ping pong with him. That was really disrespectful. And the the blue uh Godzilla was so scared that the fact that it was now a 3v1 against the other Godzilla, not the other Godzilla, the other Kong, and froze him to death, and Kong really did him so freaking dirty, I kid you not, but this one was a really dope video overall, GG2, shout out to you man, for dropping this, if you haven't seen the video, uh, the movie is called Godzilla x Kong, the new em empire, I highly recommend you check it out, because that movie is pure hands, I kid you not, but comment down below, let me know if you guys enjoyed this video, I appreciate the time, I love y'all so much for showing love and support to the channel, and if you're new to the channel, make sure you run the like, subscribe, tap that bell so you don't miss any videos that I post all that good stuff, also, your boy has a second channel, it's called Hand on Anime, I'm going to be, I am almost done editing, and I'm going to be dropping that video sometime this week, so be on the look, look for that, I will leave it in my uh, second channel link down in the description box, show some love on to that, and if you have, have any, uh, anime suggestion that you want me to talk about y'all already know what to do there's a comment section for a reason so i appreciate the time broke 1k it's up and stuck appreciate y'all chilling with me peace